We are back after a long time. Three weeks? Four weeks? Mm. You don't know? No. Nope. We've been doing a lot of grand battle. Recorded a lot of episodes for that so far. I'm just glad that the save file is still here, so. So, we have to find the, um, the last dungeon on our own. So, I was looking at our old videos and we found the clues. Something of uh, Spectacle Rock is the entrance to death. So, just gonna do some money runs, get some potions. We're gonna go venture forth and pretty sure I believe where the my guess would be it's in that the hard area with all those centaur kind of guys oh, I should take out these guys because they could drop bombs I'm not sure if I'm. Uh, what are these pig guys called? Uh, moblins. I'm not sure if they have a higher chance. I feel it sometimes just feels like they have a higher chance of uh, the blue ones have a higher chance of dropping bombs than other enemies, but it could be just the same as the Octa Rocks. I got my, it's 5th today, January the 5th, 2017, I got my teeth pulled out yesterday. Eating jello really doesn't help. Like they were fine today, like my gums are fine today. I'm not sore or anything, but I eat that, that jello and just now I had like one bite. Jello. And it's making them act up. Also I'm not supposed to lick it, but my uh where they, you know, where the teeth were removed. I've been doing that a lot yesterday, so that's not good. And I was gagging a lot. I, tried, I had to take my antibiotics because one, one of my molar teeth, uh, my wisdom teeth, sorry, were, was infected. And I was gagging a lot trying to take it. Okay, this isn't what I want. Um, Yeah, I went the wrong way this to the second dungeon. Where I wanted to go is, I think I go up. I go, go yeah. back. There. Why? It looks like a dog. Like upside down. No, that side's the head. The part you're near is the tail. And you, the bar. What's this? That's the tail. That's the tail. Yes. Oh. Well, what's this then? It's poop. That's not there. No, because you said where I am is the tail, so I thought Probably this was the tail, yeah. so this is like a bump on top. So this is its tail, and this is its poop coming out. Sure. That's the only way it'll work, Magnus. Sure. But it looks like a dog. This whole thing just stopped like making fire afterwards. It really hurts me more than it hurts the enemies more. There we go. These guys drop. Uh, usually drop money often enough. It looks like an area from the link to the past. Almost enough for potions. There's the, there it is. That's the rock, right? Maybe. Hmm. It's the blue. Yeah, it's just gonna bring me to a dungeon.
Oh, cool. Didn't need that. What if I do it when I'm next to the rock? Hmm. Okay. So we gotta find this. Uh, the thing is, though, this isn't completely blind, because Magnus did know some stuff he's remembered from online, so... There we go. Is that it? Fire does help against these guys. The stairs, what? There's too much action going on. Also, who shoots swords? Why not make it spears or something? Who shoots a sword? So I was watching this, um... Uh, Gang Grumps. There we go. Actually, I have no idea if this is right. This just leads to nowhere. This just leads to, like... The other side is just uh, another one that's blue, like things on top there, where it just leads me up. So, maybe it's somewhere here. So I don't have potions. This is what we've already done. Yep. E.T. Purple guy. Thank <laughs> you. 
The guy feels like really just not intimidating, just the one. Like I forget that he's actually this really strong enemy. Anyway. Well, I know where this- I don't think- I think it may just be a hidden rupee. But I do know something that we can bomb now, because... I was watching a Game Grumps, these things called Dan out of, out of Context, where... It just uses certain lines Dan says, and like, there's... I found them just really funny on their own when you don't know what he was talking about beforehand. But there's something I saw that they bombed that I know that we can bomb. I just don't know how to get I, uh, I have to find it. Well, that's great. I just killed, what, four of them? And those guys usually drop, like, the five rupees. Yeah, maybe we should just look it up at the end of this episode. Since we kind of, I mean, we've kind of cheated already, you know. This isn't completely blind. The only excuse I could give for you, like, with the stuff you already know, is that, like, you know, people talk about this kind of stuff. Like, you know, they share their information. What do you mean it looked familiar? Well, I... Well, one time I did see something like that. And it... Went, well, I did see someone... I saw the completionist uh, bomb that wall. And that... and But it didn't show what it was. It's an arrow. I think it's game designer, it's wonderful. Is that joke still relevant? No, man, that game came out in like what, 97? 96? 96, right? Yeah. Yeah. Or 97, anyway. Ow. Ow. My gums. Can't look them, but I want to. So the weird thing about my gums is that, um, years ago on my wisdom teeth, uh, my bottom right one and left, there's like, some, some, uh, my gum, I don't know what, I'm pretty sure I've heard another word for what they're called, but, it was, there's like this, this stick of it, oh, here we go. Yeah, this is what I was, uh, this is what- But which one? That one. The one on the left. Those rocks look like boobies to me. Yeah, that's what the completion it's entered. I I pretty I was gonna bomb them anyway, because it's like the spectacle rock. Well those are rocks. It was just a matter of which one. Alright, let's see how far we can get in without a potion. Well, this is easy, but I have a hunch. Okay, I'm out of bombs now. But this will be, when we beat this, this will be my first Zelda game I beat. The Wii 
gonna do two? Um, I'm gonna use a guide for it, but we're gonna wait a few months. Does that game like it's really just not obvious? Yeah, I'm also gonna get some more money just in case I have to get potions another time afterwards. Well, well. We found it. And we had want to use the internet. What are games, since we, we, I just mentioned that, what are games that you had to like, you had a friend who was like, where you had to like, talk to a friend to figure it out? Mm. I'm not sure you would really have any kind of thing, any situations like that you were in. You're, you're, the people at your school aren't really big on old school games. My I, well, I, I, I've told a story about that, I think, during our... Sorry, what were you just saying? Well, there was this one time my friend Jacob, uh... We were, he told me about that secret in Alfred Sapphire. About finding that special egg. And something like that. But I... When I beat, he told me when I beat the game, uh, there's, there's a way to get that secret egg, but I don't remember what, he, what it, what it was. Yeah, well, usually you always get, like, some kind of egg when you end those games. Even sun and moon. You know what's amazing? What? Well, it's a bit of a, it's a spoiler if you don't want to know about these things, uh, for, like, the people. But you can catch... You, you can catch Espeon. Which is one of the EV transfer, uh, transfer me. It, it was very, like, very uncommon. I, I spent, like, quite a lot of time in the area where it is, and I only found an EV once. And I, I, I fainted it. But I do have an Eevee, because you get an egg and there's an Eevee inside, that's another spoiler, but you can actually just catch one of its evolutions. Also you can buy you can buy water, leaf, and fire stones in the game, so uh, and water, thunder stones, so Okay. So I think we're going to end this episode short because the amount of time for the rest of the episode will be just me us getting back to back to the dungeon, okay? Okay. So what I'm going to do is these guys hopefully will drop it. I'm going to go to area though. I'll get some bombs. And we'll start back at the the next, uh, at the dungeon. See you.